Hello friends, we are final year mechanical engineering students studying at Charotar University of Science and Technology, Gujarat. We have a conceptual design of a dual support ventilator to fight COVID-19. Here is our entry for MHRD Mega Online Challenge Samadha. What is a dual support ventilator? It is a single ventilator that treats two patients simultaneously. What is the necessity of a dual support ventilator? As per data available with National Health Profile 2019, there are a total of 7,13,000 government hospital beds. That is 0.55 beds per thousand population. So, the total number of beds of ICU in government hospitals ranges from 35,000 to 57,000. So, if we consider that the 50% of the beds have the facility of ventilator that is around 17,000 to 25,000. Now as per today that is 14th April 2020 the number of COVID-19 patients in India is 10,363. Now if in case the conditions worsens we will definitely require more ventilators. Why COVID-19 patients need ventilators to survive coronavirus? According to the World Health Organization, 1. In 6 COVID-19 patients becomes seriously ill and has difficulty in breathing. More than 40% of the COVID-19 patients develop acute respiratory distress syndrome. As the transfer process is impaired and oxygen levels fall, ventilators keep patient breathing. Ventilators gently pump air through a breathing tube into the patient's lung and allow the patient to exhale. This gives patients oxygen and removes carbon dioxide which can damage the patient's organ if not expelled. This is the flow diagram of our dual support ventilator. The system comprises of a pneumatic system with pressure relief valve, embo bag, oxygen tubes, oxygen mask and T-section tube through which oxygen would flow to the two patients simultaneously. Air filters and one-way valves are used in system to ensure that only and only pure oxygen is supplied to the patients. Embo bag is the main component of our system. The air from this bag is sent to the patients when we compress it with help of an automated pneumatic plunger. The volume of the air supplied to the patients is controlled by the two pressure control valves. These control valves will act as a feedback element and it will send back the signals to the pneumatic plunger by taking in account the volume of the air required by the patients and their respective breathing cycles. The pressure applied by the plunger and the volume released by the embo bag will be such that the patients get ample amount of oxygen. This is the system diagram of our dual support ventilator. As discussed above, the plunger will apply pressure on the embo bag. As a result, the air from the embo bag will be supplied to the two patients through the T-shaped tubes. Thank you. Please like and share if you like this video.